Animation is the process of creating a continuous motion and shape change illusion by means of the rapid display of a sequence of static images that minimally differ from each other. The illusion a euro is in motion pictures in general a euro is thought to rely on the phi phenomenon. Animators are artists who specialize in the creation of animation. Animations can be recorded on either analog media, such as a flip book, motion picture film, videotape, or on digital media, including formats such as animated GIF, flash animation or digital video. To display it, a digital camera, computer, or projector are used. Animation creation methods include the traditional animation creation method and those involving stop-motion animation of two- and three-dimensional objects, such as paper cutouts, puppets and clay figures. Images are displayed in a rapid succession, usually 24, 25, 30, or 60 frames per second. Etymology, from Latin anima tia, the act of bringing to life. From anima and atia. History. Early examples of attempts to capture the phenomenon of motion into a still drawing can be found in Paleolithic cave paintings, where animals are often depicted with multiple legs in superimposed positions, clearly attempting to convey the perception of motion. An earthen goblet discovered at the site of the 5,200-year-old burnt city in southeastern Iran, depicts what could possibly be the world a Euro unregistered trademark's oldest example of animation. The artifact bears five sequential images depicting a Persian desert ibex jumping up to eat the leaves of a tree. Ancient Chinese records contain several mentions of devices that were said to give an impression of movement to human or animal figures, but these accounts are unclear and may only refer to the actual movement of the figures through space. In the 19th century, the Phenakistoscope, Zoetrope and Praxinoscope, as well as the common flip book, were early animation devices that produced an illusion of movement from a series of sequential drawings, but animation did not develop further until the advent of motion picture film and cinematography in the 1890s. The Sina copyright matography was a projector, printer, and camera in one machine that allowed moving pictures to be shown successfully on a screen which was invented by history's earliest filmmakers, Auguste and Louis Lumiere, in 1894. The first animated projection was created in France, by Charles Apermil Mal Reynaud, who was a French science teacher. Reynaud created the Praxinoscope in 1877 and the Thocent der Optique in December 1888. On October 28, 1892, he projected the first animation in public, Parva Pierrot, at the Musée Copyright et Gras Copyright Van in Paris. This film is also notable as the first known instance of film perforations being used. His films were not photographed, but drawn directly onto the transparent strip. In 1900, more than 500,000 people had attended these screenings. The first film that was recorded on standard picture film and included animated sequences was the 1900 Enchanted Drawing, which was followed by the first entirely animated film. The 1906 humorous phases of Funny Faces by J. Stuart Blackton, who, because of that, is considered the father of American animation. In Europe, the French artist, a Permil Mile COHL, created the first animated film using what came to be known as traditional animation creation methods, the 1908 Phantasmagorie. The film largely consisted of a stick figure moving about and encountering all manner of morphing objects such as a wine bottle that transforms into a flower. There were also sections of live action in which the Animatora Euro unregistered trademark S hands would enter the scene. The film was created by drawing each frame on paper and then shooting each frame onto negative film, which gave the picture a blackboard look. The author of the first puppet animated film was the Russian-born director Ladislaw Sterwich, known as Ladislaw Sterevich. The more detailed hand-drawn animations, requiring a team of animators drawing each frame manually with detailed backgrounds and characters, were those directed by Winsor Mackay, a successful newspaper cartoonist, including the 1911 Little Nemo, the 1914 Gertie the Dinosaur, and the 1918 The Sinking of the Lusitania. During the 1910s, the production of animated short films, typically referred to as cartoons, became an industry of its own and cartoon shorts were produced for showing in movie theaters. 
The most successful producer at the time was John Randolph Bray, who, along with animator Earl Hurd, patented the cell animation process which dominated the animation industry for the rest of the decade. El Apocube still was a 1917 Argentine animated film utilizing cutout animation, and the world's first animated feature film. Unfortunately, a fire that destroyed producer Frederico Valls' film studio incinerated the only known copy of El Apocube still, and it is now considered a lost film. Computer animation has become popular since Toy Story, the first feature-length animated film completely made using this technique. In 2008, the animation market was worth 68.4 billion US dollars. Animation as an art and industry continues to thrive as of the mid 2010s because well-made animated projects can find audiences across borders and in all four quadrants. Animated feature-length films returned the highest gross margins of all film genres in the 2004 to 2013 time frame. Techniques: Traditional animation Traditional animation was the process used for most animated films of the 20th century. The individual frames of a traditionally animated film are photographs of drawings, first drawn on paper. To create the illusion of movement, each drawing differs slightly from the one before it. The animator's drawings are traced or photocopied onto transparent acetate sheets called cells, which are filled in with paints in assigned colors or tones on the side opposite the line drawings. The completed character cells are photographed one by one against a painted background by a rostrum camera onto motion picture film. The traditional cell animation process became obsolete by the beginning of the 21st century. Today, animators' drawings and the backgrounds are either scanned into or drawn directly into a computer system. Various software programs are used to color the drawings and simulate camera movement and effects. The final animated piece is output to one of several delivery media, including traditional 35 on film and newer media such as digital video. The look of traditional cell animation is still preserved, and the character animator's work has remained essentially the same over the past 70 years. Some animation producers have used the term tradigital to describe cell animation which makes extensive use of computer technology. Examples of traditionally animated feature films include Pinocchio, Animal Farm, and L'Illusionist. Traditionally animated films which were produced with the aid of computer technology include The Lion King, Akira, Center Chira no Kamakakushi, Les Triplets de Belleville, and The Secret of Kells. Full animation refers to the process of producing high-quality traditionally animated films that regularly use detailed drawings and plausible movement, having a smooth animation. Fully animated films can be made in a variety of styles, from more realistically animated works such as those produced by the Walt Disney Studio to the more cartoon styles of the Warner Brothers Animation Studio. Many of the Disney animated features are examples of full animation, as are non-Disney works such as The Secret of NIMH, The Iron Giant, and Nocturna. Limited animation involves the use of less detailed and or more stylized drawings and methods of movement usually a choppy or skippy movement animation. Pioneered by the artists at the American Studio United Productions of America, limited animation can be used as a method of stylized artistic expression, as in Gerald McBoyne Boyung, Yellow Submarine, and much of the anime produced in Japan. Its primary use, however, has been in producing cost-effective animated content for media such as television and later the Internet. Rotoscoping is a technique patented by Max Fleischer in 1917 where animators trace live-action movement, frame by frame. The source film can be directly copied from actors' outlines into animated drawings, as in The Lord of the Rings, or used in a stylized and expressive manner, as in Waking Life and A Scanner Darkly. Some other examples are fire and ice and heavy metal. Live-action animation is a technique combining hand-drawn characters into live-action shots. One of the earlier users was in Coco the Clown when Coco was drawn over live-action footage. Other examples include Who Framed Roger Rabbit, Space Jam and Osmosis Jones. Stop-motion animation Stop-motion animation is used to describe animation created by physically manipulating real-world objects and photographing them one frame of film at a time to create the illusion of movement. There are many different types of stop-motion animation, 
usually named after the medium used to create the animation. Computer software is widely available to create this type of animation. However, traditional stop-motion animation is usually less expensive and time-consuming to produce than current computer animation. Puppet animation typically involves stop-motion puppet figures interacting in a constructed environment, in contrast to real-world interaction in model animation. The puppets generally have an armature inside of them to keep them still and steady as well as to constrain their motion to particular joints. Examples include The Tale of the Fox, The Nightmare Before Christmas, Corpse Bride, Coraline, the films of J.R. and Registered Trademark Atunka and the TV series Robot Chicken. Puppy Toon, created using techniques developed by George Powell, are puppet animated films which typically use a different version of a puppet for different frames rather than simply manipulating one existing puppet. Clay animation, or plasticine animation, uses figures made of clay or a similar malleable material to create stop-motion animation. The figures may have an armature or wireframe inside, similar to the related puppet animation, that can be manipulated to pose the figures. Alternatively, the figures may be made entirely of clay, such as in the films of Bruce Bickford, where clay creatures morph into a variety of different shapes. Examples of clay animated works include the Gumby Show Morph Shorts, Wallace and Gromit Shorts, Jan Angstrom Vank Modge's Dimensions of Dialogue, The Trap Door. Films include Wallace and Gromit, The Curse of the War Rabbit, Chicken Run and The Adventures of Mark Twain. Cut-out animation is a type of stop-motion animation produced by moving two-dimensional pieces of material such as paper or cloth. Examples include Terry Gilliam's animated sequences from Monty Python's Flying Circus. Fantastic Planeter. Tale of Tales, the pilot episode of the TV series of South Park and the music video Live for the Moment, from Verona Riot's band. Silhouette animation is a variant of cutout animation in which the characters are backlit and only visible as silhouettes. Examples include The Adventures of Prince Achmed and Princess A Princesses. Model animation refers to stop-motion animation created to interact with and exist as a part of a live-action world. Intercutting, matte effects, and split screens are often employed to blend stop-motion characters or objects with live actors and settings. Examples include the work of Ray Harryhausen, as seen in films such Jason and the Argonauts, and the work of Willis O'Brien on films such as King Kong. Go motion is a variant of model animation that uses various techniques to create motion blur between frames of film, which is not present in traditional stop motion. The technique was invented by Industrial Light and Magic and Phil Tippett to create special effects scenes for the film The Empire Strikes Back. Another example is the dragon named Vermithrax from Dragon Slayer. Object animation refers to the use of regular inanimate objects in stop motion animation as opposed to specially created items. Graphic animation uses non-drawn flat visual graphic material, which is sometimes manipulated frame by frame to create movement. At other times, the graphics remain stationary, while the stop-motion camera is moved to create on-screen action. Brick for May subgenre of object animation involving using Lego or other similar brick toys to make an animation. These have had a recent boost in popularity with the advent of video sharing sites like YouTube and the availability of cheap cameras and animation software. Pixelation involves the use of live humans as stop motion characters. This allows for a number of surreal effects, including disappearances and reappearances, allowing people to appear to slide across the ground, and other such effects. Examples of pixelation include The Secret Adventures of Tom Thumb and Angry Kid Shorts. Computer Animation Computer animation encompasses a variety of techniques, the unifying factor being that the animation is created digitally on a computer. 2D animation techniques tend to focus on image manipulation while 3D techniques usually build virtual worlds in which characters and objects move and interact. 3D animation can create images that seem real to the viewer. 2D animation 2D animation figures are created and or edited on the computer using 2D bitmap graphics or created and edited using 2D vector graphics. 
This includes automated computerized versions of traditional animation techniques such as interpolated morphing, onion skinning and interpolated rotoscoping. 2D animation has many applications, including analog computer animation, flash animation and PowerPoint animation. Cinemagraphs are still photographs in the form of an animated GIF file of which part is animated. 2D terms, final line advection animation, a technique that gives the artists and animators a lot more influence and control over the final product as everything is done within the same department. In Paperman, we did the Euro unregistered trademark T have a cloth department and we did the Euro unregistered trademark T have a hair department. Here, folds in the fabric, hair silhouettes and the like come from of the committed design decision making that comes with the 2D drawn process. Our animators can change things, actually erase away the CG underlay if they want, and change the profile of the arm. And they can design all the fabric in that Milt Carl kind of way, if they want to. 3D animation 3D animation is digitally modeled and manipulated by an animator. The animator starts by creating an external 3D mesh to manipulate. A mesh is a geometric configuration that gives the visual appearance of form to a 3D object or 3D environment. The mesh may have many vertices which are the geometric points which make up the mesh. It is given an internal digital skeletal structure called an armature that can be used to control the mesh with weights. This process is called rigging and can be programmed for movement with keyframes. Other techniques can be applied, such as mathematical functions, simulated thermal hair, and effects such as fire and water simulations. These techniques fall under the category of 3D dynamics. 3D terms Cell shaded animation is used to mimic traditional animation using CG software. Shading looks stark, with less blending of colors. Examples include, Skaland, Apple Seed X Machina, The Legend of Zelda, Wind Waker, Machinima Euro films created by screen capturing in video games and virtual worlds. Motion capture is used when live action actors wear special suits that allow computers to copy their movements into CG characters. Examples include Polar Express, Beowulf, A Christmas Carol, The Adventures of Tintin. Photorealistic animation is used primarily for animation that attempts to resemble real life, using advanced rendering that mimics in detail skin, plants, water, fire, clouds, etc. Examples include Up, Kung Fu Panda, Ice Age. Mechanical animation. Animatronics is the use of mechatronics to create machines which seem animate rather than robotic. Audio animatronics and autonomatronics is a form of robotics animation, combined with 3D animation, created by Walt Disney Imagineering for shows and attractions at Disney theme parks move and make noise, but are fixed to whatever supports them. They can sit and stand but cannot walk. An audio animatron is different from an android type robot in that it uses pre recorded movements and sounds, rather than responding to external stimuli. In 2009, Disney created an interactive version of the technology called Autonomatronics. Linear animation generator is a form of animation by using static picture frames installed in a tunnel or a shaft. The animation illusion is created by putting the viewer in a linear motion, parallel to the installed picture frames. The concept and the technical solution were invented in 2007 by my eye girl Oven in Romania. Chuckimation is a type of animation created by the makers of the Cartoon Action League now, in which characters' props are thrown, or chucked from off camera or wiggled around to simulate talking by unseen hands. Puppetry is a form of theater or performance, the animation that involves the manipulation of puppets. It is very ancient and is believed to have originated 3000 years BC. 1. Puppetry takes many forms but they all share the process of animating inanimate performing objects. Puppetry is used in almost all human societies both as entertainment a euro and performance a euro, and ceremonially in rituals and celebrations such as carnivals. Most puppetry involves storytelling. Zoetrope is a device that produces the illusion of motion from a rapid succession of static pictures. The term Zoetrope is from the Greek words I paragraph I permil I registered trademark, meaning alive, active, 
and I I I Y Euro I I, meaning turn, with Zoetrop taken to mean active turn, or will of life. Other animation styles, techniques and approaches. Hydrotechnics, a technique that includes lights, water, fire, fog, and lasers, with high-definition projections on mist screens. Drawn on film animation, a technique where footage is produced by creating the images directly on film stock, for example by Norman McLaren, Len Lye and Stan Brackage. Paint on glass animation, a technique for making animated films by manipulating slow-drying oil paints on sheets of glass, for example by Alexander Petrov. Erasure animation, a technique using traditional 2D media, photographed over time as the artist manipulates the image. For example, William Kentridge is famous for his charcoal erasure films, and Pyat Dumeyer for his auteur technique of animating scratches on plaster. Pin screen animation, makes use of a screen filled with movable pins that can be moved in or out by pressing an object onto the screen. The screen is lit from the side so that the pins cast shadows. The technique has been used to create animated films with a range of textural effects difficult to achieve with traditional cell animation. Sound animation, sound is moved around on a back or front lighted piece of glass to create each frame for an animated film. This creates an interesting effect when animated because of the light contrast. Flipbook, a flipbook is a book with a series of pictures that vary gradually from one page to the next, so that when the pages are turned rapidly, the pictures appear to animate by simulating motion or some other change. Flipbooks are often illustrated books for children, but may also be geared towards adults and employ a series of photographs rather than drawings. Flipbooks are not always separate books, but may appear as an added feature in ordinary books or magazines, often in the page corners. Software packages and websites are also available that convert digital video files into custom-made flipbooks. Character animation, multi-sketching, special effects animation, production, the creation of non-trivial animation works has developed as a form of filmmaking, but with certain unique aspects. One thing live action and animated feature length films do have in common is that they are both extremely labor intensive and horrendously expensive. The most important difference is that while it is easy for the director to ask for one more take during principal photography of a live action film, or to add on one more day for pickup shots, every take on an animated film must be manually rendered by animators. It makes no sense for a studio to pay the salaries of dozens of animators to spend weeks creating a visually dazzling five-minute scene, if that scene fails to effectively advance the plot of the film. Thus, animation studios began the practice in the 1930s of maintaining story departments where storyboard artists develop every single scene through storyboards then handing the film over to the animators only after the production team is satisfied that all the scenes will make sense as a whole. Another problem is the necessity of ensuring that the style of an animated film is consistent from start to finish, even as films have grown longer and teams have grown larger. Animators, like all artists, necessarily have their own individual art styles, but must subordinate their individuality in a consistent way to whatever style was selected for a particular film. This problem is usually solved by having a separate group of visual development artists develop an overall look and palette for each film before animation begins. Character designers on the visual development team draw numerous examples of how each character should look like with different facial expressions, posed in different positions, and viewed from different angles. On traditionally animated projects, Maquettes were often sculpted to further help the animators see how characters would look from different angles. Unlike live-action films, animated films were traditionally developed beyond the synopsis stage through the storyboard format. The storyboard artists would then receive credit for writing the film. In the 1960s, animation studios began hiring professional screenwriters to write screenplays and such screenplays had become commonplace for animated films by the late 1980s. Awards, as with any other form of media, Animation Do has instituted awards for excellence in the field. The original awards for animation were presented by the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences for animated shorts from the year 1932, during the Fifth Academy Awards function. The first winner of the Academy Award was the short Flowers and Trees, 
a production by Walt Disney Productions and United Artists. However, the Academy Award for a feature-length animated motion picture was only instituted for the year 2001, and awarded during the 74th Academy Awards in 2002. It was won by the movie Shrek, produced by DreamWorks and Pacific Data Images. Since then, Disney Pixar have produced the most movies either to win or be nominated for the award. The list of both awards can be obtained here, Academy Award for Best Animated Feature, Academy Award for Best Animated Short Film, several other countries have instituted an award for Best Animated Feature Film as part of their National Film Awards, BAFTA Award for Best Animated Film, Car Copyright Tsar Award for Best Animated Film, Goya Award for Best Animated Film, Japan Academy Prize for Animation of the Year. Also since 2007, the Asia Pacific Screen Award for Best Animated Feature Film has been awarded at the Asia Pacific Screen Awards. Since 2009, the European Film Awards have awarded the European Film Award for Best Animated Film. The Annie Award is another award presented for excellence in the field of animation. Unlike the Academy Awards, the Annie Awards are only received for achievements in the field of animation and not for any other field of technical and artistic endeavor. They were reorganized in 1992 to create a new field for Best Animated Feature. The 1990s winners were dominated by Walt Disney, however newer studios, led by Pixar and DreamWorks, have now begun to consistently vie for this award. The list of awardees is as follows, Annie Award for Best Animated Feature, see also, 12 Basic Principles of Animation, Animation Software, Architectural Animation, Tradigital Art, Avar. Computer Generated Imagery, International Tour and a Copyright of Animation, List of Motion Picture Topics, Wireframe Model, Motion Graphic Design, Model Sheet, Notes. References Further reading, Anderson, Joseph and Barbara, The Myth of Persistence of Vision Revisited, Journal of Film and Video, Volume 45, No. 1, 3-12, Culhane, Shamus, Animation Script to Screen, Laban. Kit, The Animation Book, Musa, S. Zayatin, R. Griffiths, C. Introduction to Computer Animation and Its Possible Educational Applications. In M. Gallagher, J. Gunaraga, Z. Chinasova, M. M. Chovankova, New Challenges in Education. Retrospection of History of Education to the Future and the Interdisciplinary Dialogue Among Didactics of Various School Subjects. Rui Three Quarters on Brock. Slovakia, Verbum a Euro Vida Vitea 3 quarters STV O Catola CKEJ on Ivitsity V Rui 3 quarters Ombiku. Led, Trish, Rani, Doug, and Patton, Frederick, Complete Anime Guide, Japanese Animation Film Directory and Resource Guide, Tiger Mountain Press 1997, Low, Richard and Schnotz, Wolfgang Learning with Animation. Research Implications for Design Cambridge University Press. 2008, Masson, Terence, CG101, A Computer Graphics Industry Reference Unique and Personal Histories of Early Computer Animation Production, plus a comprehensive foundation of the industry for all reading levels. ISBN 978-0-9778710-0-1, Sorenko, Alexander. The development of an instrument to measure the degree of animation predisposition of agent users, Computers in Human Behavior Vol. 23, No. 1, 478-495. Thomas, Frank and Johnston, Ollie, Disney Animation, The Illusion of Life, at the Ville 1981, Walters, Faber and Helen, Animation Unlimited, Innovative Short Films Since 1940, HarperCollins Publishers. 2004, Williams, Richard, The Animator's Survival Kit ISBN 978-0-571-20228-7, Bob Godfrey and Anna Jackson, The Do-It-Yourself Film Animation Book BBC Publications 1974 ISBN 978-0-563-10829-0 Now out of Print but available less hand through a range of sources such as Amazon UK. Lawson, Tim and Eliza Persons. The Magic Behind the Voices, 
a who's who of cartoon voice actors. University Press of Mississippi, 2004 Ball, R. Beck, J. Demott R. Deneroff, H. Stein, D. Gladstone, F. Not, T. Leal, A. Maestri, G. Mallory, M. Meisen, M. McCracken, H. Maguire, D. Nigel, J. Patton, F. Pointer, R. Webb, P. Robinson, C. Ryan, W. Scott, K. Snyder, A. And Webb, G. Animation Art, From Pencil to Pixel, The History of Cartoon, Anime and CGI. Fulham London Flame Tree Publishing. ISBN 978-1-84451-140-2, Crafton, Donald. Before Mickey. Cambridge, Massachusetts The MIT Press. ISBN 978-0-262-03083-0, Solomon, Charles. Enchanted Drawings, The History of Animation. New York Random House, Inc. ISBN 978-0-394-54684-1, External Links, Animation at DMOZ, Experimental Animation Techniques, The Making of an 8-Minute Cartoon Short, Amy Mando, a 12-minute film demonstrating 10 different animation techniques.